Hello everyone. Welcome to Wow's Wedding, Wedding Talks. Talks from the house of Wow's by Siddhi Soma. Where we talk about love, life and everything in between. So as we launched our new channel, we were having a group discussion with our team what should be our first episode about and who should be the first guest. And then our director said, you guys being in a marriage for a decade, why can't you host each other? And it sounded pretty much interesting to me. But she said she has a rule. So the rule is our director wrote few questions for each of us and kept them here and we don't know what they are about. Which means it's like a blind date with our own show. No script, no preps and full of surprises. Come on guys, let's discover the surprises together and let's kick start the new channel with a lot of excitement. Okay, who is going first? Head of the house. All right, fine. I'm the head of the house. I'll take it. Uh, okay. What is love and how do I make you feel loved? For me, love is nothing but, you know, letting, letting the person be however he is. Instead of asking him to be changed or completely, you know, expecting him to turn like another version of you. No, that's not love for me. So for me, in, in our case, you let me be what I am. And I really like that. So you want me to be like me and you, that gives me so much of uh, freedom. It, it let me be what I am, right? So that's, that's the best thing which happens God, between us. God, how blessed you are. <laughs> I just can't believe it. Oh my God. How blessed. Oh, it's okay. Okay, let's, now your let, turn. let me take mine. Okay, when did you realize that you love me? When we actually parted our ways. Like when I left for masters, you were here, and then there was something missing, you know. It's like a part, a part of body was missing. <laughs> you know, that's when I realized that I need this man. I, I want him as a habit. <laughs> yeah, I want, I, 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 this, this one habit that was missing. I want that routine in my life. That's when I think I realized that. Yeah. Oh, I, I never asked you this question, Siddhu. Alina, mm. what did you do, Ray? There's so many questions. Let's see. It's exciting. Okay, what's your best impression on me? Best impression on you? Like I know I'm perfect. I know I'm the best. I know that I'm your, you know, the god of your life. I know that I'm your light of your life. The best impression what I have is I don't have to talk. You will, you will just assume your things and give me rest. Okay. <laughs> I don't have to impress wives like everyone do. <laughs> no, on a serious note, what best impression I have on you is you are a perfect independent person I have seen. Generally, what do you mean by independent person? Like not financial, they, they might say financially independent and stuff, but you don't depend on anyone for your happiness. You don't depend on your mood for anyone. You don't depend on anything for on anyone. You, you are responsible for your happiness. You are responsible for your fitness. You are responsible for your money. Every damn thing you are you are individually built. I love that. That that's the impression I I love about you. Script kaad kada? Nijamme kada? Nijamme. Double chara? Payment rala inka. Fine. <laughs> fine. <laughs> what is the most funny thing about me? You are funny. <laughs> you are funny. People, you know what? People actually think that I'm a serious person. No, you are funny. People think that you are very serious, you know, is one serious, the serious head of the house, but I find you very, the most funniest thing of you is the way you dance. He's so bad at dancing, he's got the worst moves, but he tries, he puts that effort and it, it's the most funniest, guys. I wish I could show you one of the clip. I, I don't know dance. Like, I will. <laughs> me and furniture are the same. We, don't, we move in the same directions. Oh, yeah. I Forward, sidewards, that's it. That's the max we can do. All right. What's the most core memory you have with me? Core memory would be the living relationship in Bangalore. Sure. Oh, was it, sup was it not supposed to the be on air? He doesn't know this and this guy is talking everything. Fine. Okay, fine. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> we were so young. We were freshly in love. Okay. We had our fights. We had our uh, duties to do in uh, respective departments, low and all. 
but still we it was all new and uh, i could i could sense that that memory is still fresh in my mind i could say so i really like that space do you remember how we used to share our responsibilities yes of course i used to do the bed sheets and he used to do the utensils and i used to sweep and mop the house and he used to throw the garbage out that garbage <laughs> thing is shit i i hate I, i was like what was i doing in hyderabad i was running a business you know i had people under me and here coming to bangalore i'm just using i'm throwing the garbage i oh. hate touching those garbage covers and he used to do that and then he used to sink, clean the sink okay i used to put the rice and he used to clean the sink i hate that sound which comes out of sink like <laughs> it gets okay fine it's all <laughs> part of it's all part of samsaram he used to put rice he used to get the curd <laughs> what is the most important thing that i gifted you and why is it important the first apple watch that i uh, that you gifted me it's special because we were pregnant then it's special because after the pregnancy and all i i really put on weight and i really wanted to you know uh, lose that extra fat and all and i was finding it very 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 tough and this man gifted that i did not tell it to you till late <laughs> yeah, so he gifted that watch and it kind of motivated me and i watch almost r l warden you know r l warden literally 6 years i used it and uh, and it gives me it's very special because every time i look at that watch i remember this one picture where we went to this particular resort on our anniversary and then we had this nice table and there was the first time sidhu got really romantic where he made <coughs> you know he made sure the uh, table was decorated with flowers uh, a heart shaped cake you know <laughs> a table balloon which is so not sidhu he made sure uh, all of that was done because i was pregnant he was a little extra sensitive towards me and uh, so whenever i see every morning i see that watch it reminds me of that picture you me and that white table and those balloons and this cake and then yeah it kind of changed my life that little watch actually changed my life uh, it it changed me into a more disciplined person and yeah yeah that's very very special sidhu a lot just, of things anniversary know, I, if just i know that ee chinchina daniki impress aitha i wouldn't have spent lot of money on the bigger gifts nenu chinne sidhu నేను ఈజీ అయ్యి నువ్వే కాంప్లికేటెడ్గా ఆలోచించు ఓకే బిఫోర్ యూ ఆన్సర్ దిస్ క్వశ్చన్ ఇది ఫన్నీగా ఆన్సర్ చేస్తావా సీరియస్గా ఆన్సర్ చేస్తావా ముందే డిసైడ్ చేసుకొని ఆన్సర్ చేయి డిపెండ్స్ ఆన్ ద క్వశ్చన్ నో నో నథింగ్ లైక్ దాట్ నో ఇట్ యాక్చువల్లీ డిపెండ్స్ ఆన్ నో ఐ వాంట్ యూ టు డిసైడ్ అండ్ దెన్ యూ టెల్ మీ హౌ డు యూ వాంట్ మీ టు నో ఐ విల్ నాట్ టెల్ దట్ యూ డిసైడ్ దట్స్ వాట్ ఎ సర్ప్రైజెస్ ఆర్ మెంట్ ఫర్ సిద్ధు ఐ విల్ ఆన్సర్ ఇట్ ఇన్ ఎ ఫనీ వే ఆల్ రైట్ What is that one thing okay let's do both okay <laughs> <laughs> what is that one thing that i changed in you and you still like that change taking shower in the morning <laughs> <laughs> is it a funnier thing or a serious thing no it's on a funnier side it's, it is it is because i used to take my mornings little easy and i don't like to take shower in the morning i prefer taking shower in the night and sleeping than taking in the morning but you used to hate that so i had to change that habit so i did that one and the other one would be my anger on a serious note i used to be so much short tempered but after you coming i learned that to how to control them how to you know because i cannot throw my moods on you right so i started learning that earlier it used to be mom i used to just throw my moods on her i never never ever used to think how she is feeling or how she is been treated from uh, like na side nunchi because she doesn't know to express it on our case you started expressing that no siddhu you did this i i felt bad i didn't know till then i didn't knew that people might also take this anta uh, hurting untadi ani so i learned that and i i started controlling my anger much 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 better way i remember how athaya keeps telling no raka mundu siddhu vere ippu siddhu vere i like it i love that i love when everybody says that i find it like an achievement yes. yeah i did this okay next is mine so we have been to many trips right mm-hmm. so what do you think which one is my favorite trip of 
course it is ladakh okay i'll i'll give you three options right. she do i've not i've been asked only to ask one i'll i'll say three trips why three say do i i was sure sure that is le yeah it's ladakh the of course le- i okay i'm sorry uh, yeah go on let's let's talk about three trips we have right. been to so many fucking countries and so many places and so many holidays so tell me three places three trips which are my favorite your favorite all right first comes uh le ladakh trip the road trip that we've done yes right uh it was a 15 day trip on bikes and uh yeah snana le jail le do i think i'm sure it is your favorite trip yeah. and uh second is maldives where it was just you me and arun and nobody else like our little world and good food yes and um Mm, third is Langkawi. Perfect. Actually, Langkawi. First, the crabby thing which yeah. we went right after our marriage. Uh-huh. It's was it? Shall we call it a honeymoon? No. It's not. We have been. Ladakh is our honeymoon. Ladakh is our honeymoon. With fifteen other people. <laughs> yes. So we went on a group honeymoon. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ladakh, Langkawi, and Maldives. Was it right? Yeah. yeah. Okay this is interesting how do you describe me to your new friends <laughs> Come on tell me He's my husband Not that they know it How do I describe okay I'll tell you So um first I first comes always this point I'll always talk about how responsible guy you are how well, like what 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 sort of a responsibility that you take as a son as a husband as a father that's the utmost quality that i love in you so that's something that if if anybody talks about i'm the you, family man okay <laughs> if anybody talks about you i'll first more than i love you i married you this that that whatever it is i'll always talk about how responsible you were and i think that's the that's the reason why i actually fell for you in case you don't know So you saw me being responsible as a father Devan. even before you married because me. Because my mom used to call me under yadaval. Chudu, siddu, chudu. Respond. Apni look onu kunad mere yadaval mere. College ne bangati dergo thunar. That's what my mom used to I say. I banged my school. Ah, uh, she didn't know that. She doesn't know this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, because you were the you remember you were the only person who was actually trying to settle in your life, irrespective of what scale, which, how much amount, and all and all. When I was bunking my college and then roaming outside, you actually invested your money in buying a flat so that you know you can come and talk to my parents. True. You know that's where I really not just because of me, but I always feel that you know a man who respects his mum will respect every other woman on the earth is what I believe. And and in your case, I think it is totally true. I really love the way you love your mom. Like you're such a mommy's baby, not in a negative way, babe, but a very positive way. I mean, you correct her also if 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 it's a mistake. you correct her also i mean it's not that you just blindly go by you know just because your mom it's not like that i really love that fact and um, second thing is uh, i like the fact that uh, i tell this very proudly that you know this guy is never bored of me <laughs> i'm very very happy the other day also when i was discussing with my, my friends and all i was saying the same thing this man um, he actually tries to he always is in that honeymoon phase he always thinks it's just been one two years that you know in the marriage and he always acts like that and i really like it i mean it keeps the you know spark alive yeah i actually forget i mean i am i'm a person who was happy joy and all but then in in our relationship i think you are the one who is like oh yeah i just monne kada pellaindi like that. so i like it right. so what was the biggest change you felt after getting married biggest change would be i was so selfish earlier mhm and now i think about others than me more i could say like earlier earlier i used to be more about it's all about me 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 i want to do this i want to have that i want to have this mhm now i want to give this i want to give that i want to get that thing for you i want to get things for son mother blah 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 it's not only about you but also i started thinking about my parents also and it it made me a family man <laughs> mm. i would say on the other side it gave me inspiration it gave me uh 
desire to grow in career as well made me more responsible i would say i think it it does it for every every person after marriage i don't know but see one thing i would say is uh, apart from you i i want i always wanted to make you proud as an husband and my mom as a proud son but after arin i feel i want him to say that my dad is my hero so i wanted to do much much bigger things uh where he's proud of me not for the money i earn but uh, maybe maybe through my craft i would say you know i want him to recognize oh you are so and so fathers you are you are so and so person's son i i wanted that thing to happen so i i have a bigger dreams in life so one of that would be this also okay. so do you think marriage got the change in you or is it a person uh, got got change in you just to say i won't say it's marriage maybe time has done that or the over the time i've changed as a person i was totally a different person before my marriage and i've been evolving every year i would say every every fight we do i learn a thing out of it every every milestone we reach i take a new responsibility it looks like a responsibility to me than to you know enjoy that milestone so as as a person after mar- all, though all these happened after marriage but i would i would partially give the credit to my age which which we are growing like you know we started seeing i earlier i was a dependent on someone then you started depending on me i started depending on you and now there is a new life which is depend on both of us so all these things changed me over the time okay. not just the marriage <laughs> what was your first thought after our last fight i'll tell you honestly the last fight actually changed a lot of things in our relationship okay you yeah <laughs> on a good side or bad side uh good side bad side kadu thinking side yeah so so every person has their own way of dealing thing, things right so if a fight aithe i am somebody who want nika nika apde ipde 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 sort just call da ipde kucho ipde right now you want to sort it Yeah. I am somebody who is like a snail like take some time breathe in take in meditate and then I want to discuss it you know a, the- a lot of theory and practicals goes into my things but yours is like practical you wanted to sort right now we're different right so inel atla ga nadichindi but somehow last fight i thought i'll work it your way okay yeah what is my way i like to sort things sit and sort things now right now okay I have decided. So I think that's the change. I put the next fight to the list. But what was your first thought after you? This is what I thought. I should I thought I should work it his way. Okay. Let's see. Hope that works. If not I'm Question gone for toss. Huh? <laughs> If not I'm gone for toss. Less. Okay, right. your question. Chip. Ta na 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 ne. What is that one thing you are afraid to tell me? One thing I am afraid to tell you would be if I am not interested to do something which you are super excited to do. <laughs> I am afraid to tell you that I am not interested in like bother. example cheppu adi kuda dancing I am not much interested. I start forcing you I start pulling you to the dance floor. Ha ah, something like ah, that. I'll only make sure you dance in our room. <laughs> <laughs> what is next this is uh, uh, ignore next those tiny tiny things only see if if i know that you get hurt if i know that this brings you an uncomfortable stage or uncomfortable space i'm afraid to talk to you about that because intentions and the purposes would be very right but certain certain things which are your trigger points i don't want to trigger them and see how is it how do you react i i avoid going close to those trigger points not that i have to not tell these or not do these or whatever it's just that to avoid complications see i have few pick up trigger points like right? you don't touch them you deal it in a smoother way you try to avoid them or try not to bring them close to me i also follow the same pattern i not bring the trigger points close to you so those things there would be situations where i have to talk about them 
I know there are trigger points to you. Though there is nothing or they, they might not upset you or they might not, you know, really bother you. But there is a point one chances that your mood will go 10 decibels down because of that topic or that thing. So I try to avoid that, that thing. That's it. Okay. So if you can change something in this relationship, what would it be? So, um, again, I, won't, I don't think it's a bad uh, or a negative thing. But I am a person who is half theory, half practicals. Like, I want to talk first and then implement that. You don't want to talk. You just want to implement directly. No, I don't mind talking, but I don't... Okay, you tell me. 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 So, yeah. You, and you more of a... Okay, tuck, 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 tuck. Okay, this is what we've decided. We'll, we'll do this. And uh, so, I uh, think it's a comfort. It's like, you know, I wish, uh, you know, I wish I had five minutes more. <laughs> I'm a more of a theory person. I mean, not more. I mean, practicals are a lot based on theory is what I feel. So, Adi Vokati and uh, general guy, you're somebody, you're like, you're going to go to the next You just shift, like, Easy guy, it's very easy for you, transition. Na kan tizi gad, na kuchh time par thodi. So I think nein mara le mo, but then na ke end ende nein vent ne ni ni energy ni I won't be able to. Like you know after fight if I saw another John and Vasta I'll be like hmm anti our nuvo I'll be like that. So kuncham slow down na na kuncham gap unte bound de mo is what I think. I kind of need my space kuncham kuncham. You're somebody who, do, who doesn't need space, which is also good. Uh, why do I, I do what I do is... We're not fighting, right? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I am more of a person what need to be done next. Why right. it happened, how it happened, when it happened. Uh, happened, happened. Mm. None. You cannot go and undo things. Right. You learn few few lessons from it. You you conclude few points. You, you mark few red zones. And you go forward. No, going forward, what need to be done? That that uh, mentality I would be in always. Why what will never that that discussions never end. I feel yeah. that discussions will lead to another discussion, which leads to another discussion, which leads to another fight, another fight. We we go deeper, deeper, deeper dig. We will be digging deeper. I feel instead of going deeper and going backwards, let's go forward. That's the reason I say. Okay, we spoke, you didn't like this, you didn't like this, you didn't like this. Okay, these are my corrections. Okay, these are your corrections. Okay, done. Let's move forward. Let's end right. this. So that's my kind of uh, this thing. We have been like this from ages. Yeah, we've been dealing it. I think, yeah, it's the, the saying that women think uh, emotionally and men think logically. True. I think, yeah, that's where we come from. So I'm good with it. Like, okay, change you. Okay, chest. Tante sir, chayandi. Like that. <laughs> okay, we'll extend the talk to part for 15 minutes next time instead of 10 minutes. <laughs> Buy me some chocolates and listen to you. <laughs> Different way. What's that one thing or phase you wish we were never been through? So there was only one time we had a distance mm. like any other couple. After, after maternity, you find a gap. You find a dif- distance. It's like the, your friend is going from a school holidays and after he comes back, he's acting weird. He is acting differently. They act weird. So you went on a maternity leave <laughs> to your mom's place and you came out as a new different person because you came along with the baggage, you came along with Arin, you came along with so many responsibilities. Okay. So I could see a drastic, drastic shift of you know me being the center frame me being the side actor somewhere there and Arin being in the center. Oh, it's not... Yeah, of course I felt jealous. <laughs> of course I felt jealous. It's not... It's a healthy jealous, I would say. But as a relation, as a family, we were going right. together. We we could see someone new and we were excited. We were loving him and all. But as a, as a couple, I it was not enough for me as a couple. That that guy happened. We didn't, we didn't plan for him or anything. If we had a plan... Then I would have done it after two, three years more. So it, it's it's kind of a shocker to me. Good shocker, of course. But it's like 
someone took away my my quota <laughs> kind of thing so i wish that could have been little pushed to 2 3 years more okay so we would have had better chalas few more few more years together without the third wheel <laughs> you were just jealous man that's all is a sweet fellow did alina's question help you anything the questions yeah okay, two Which days since you... koncha mental block lo unna koncha jari payanni i feel it's good yeah yeah it's nice nice the questions are actually good you know okay do you want to say something to me right now i love you you apart from that i know that <laughs> don't change the way you were you are be the same responsible person as you always were because i loved you for that and uh ante <laughs> ante okay what's you you don't know anni nene cheppala what do i want to say something about you right now uh would be you have always been the strong support you were always been the a uh, mood setter so if if you stop being extra active which you are generally if you are just being normal also things around me would be the same All right so you have to meet that energy point which you generally meet if you like if you behave like me then it's boring <laughs> i have to behave like me you have to behave like you just consider yourself boring <laughs> i'm not yeah if you consider i am not yeah oh, okay fine no i am not boring person but yeah i am a boring person like people who with a Socially high boring. voltage yeah. people would definitely see me as a boring person people would think deeper would see me as an interesting person no, yeah, i think you are an introvert in a group of extroverts <laughs> i am i am an extrovert in the, in the group of introvert no i am an extrovert if you put all the introverts in one room oh, i'll be an extrovert oh, actually yeah actually yeah <laughs> right cool so i have a quick rapid uh, fire like just like karan johar okay where did this come from just this? like that random ipde raskunna gap lo okay okay let's see how much you know me because you did not know anything about me did, did you so did not even know the film that i like okay fine all right if not for whatever i'm doing what would i have been doing by now what best you would have been doing yep. some teacher i don't know which level where either you would be teaching kids or you would be teaching architects or you would be teaching yoga you would be teaching dance but you love teaching so you would be in teaching segment is it right i did not expect this i thought you would say dr gaina kan jabta anukunna nice it's you are pass confused over you you pass you passed <laughs> it's clear gynec is your childhood dream but yes. right now if you have given a chance you would jump into would teaching. teaching yes either it can be scuba also but you want to teach someone yes all right skydiving or scuba scuba diving scuba diving always all right for right. you yeah for me sky okay mountains or beaches you are a beach person i am a mountain person Why am I giving my answers also <laughs> in between? <laughs> um, food or sex? Food for you, sex for me. <laughs> um, who would I choose? My father or husband? You choose husband. I did. You gave two <laughs> options. If you had given the third option, I would have said that only. All right, well, okay. Ranbir Kapoor or Ranveer Singh? Ranveer Kapoor or Ranveer Singh? Ranveer Ran- Kapoor or Ranveer Singh? You are Singh. I I pick up the Kapoor. <laughs> Deepika Padukone. <laughs> Deepika Padukone. <laughs> What is that? Yeah. <laughs> All right, we done. Okay, done. I liked it. I like it too. Okay, fine. I've never knew so many things about Bargavi before. At least I knew, but I never thought of asking these questions and hearing the answers out. So. I think you all also should try this at home. It's it's risky free friends. <laughs> Depends on the questions you ask of course. Do try this at home. Nice it was a great session Siddu. 
yeah uh, doing a little formal informal stuff i think i like it <laughs> I, i really love it next thing prepare just think chala questions prepare just that but yeah you're not going to see our boring faces again and again we are going to have new faces new topics also next episode we're talking about how men and women think differently oh my god trust me <laughs> that's going to be really fun because i'm calling a guest it's it's more about the perspective not the fun i don't know how much the fun part would be but it's more like we had a discussion right so i as a men we think a different uh, way we think more logically and the women think more emotionally so we want to talk more about that and we are making an amazing episode out of that and uh, we are much excited about the guest so do comment your questions which you think we should discuss on the next episode to follow us guys and hang on to the space for more content yes from wow's wedding talks see ya